Hey all, oh, this is Amber here with another vlog. Um, what is this? Vlog 3? Part 3 of Operation Beautiful Swar. Okay, so I went for the past couple of days. I had my spacers and I had eight spacers and then um, I got fitted for a Palsa expander and then after I got fitted, they put six spacers back in for clear my teeth. And then today I went in to get those spacers removed and to get the powerful expander put into my mouth. Um, my experience with the thing and the powerful expander being put in my mouth is very very painful but i think it was mostly very painful only because because of the spacers it made because the spacers made my teeth very very sore and um essentially they're just like shoving metal bands around your teeth and it hurts really really bad and um, when I went to the orthodontist today to officially get it put in, the assistant was doing it. And I think she was doing it very, very wrong because she put me through a lot, a lot of pain. And then when the doctor came over, I wasn't in pain as much. But I think it's okay. And, you know, you can't learn if you don't do. I'm so kind of disappointed that it had to be me, but I'm not complaining. Um, everyday life with the palto expander is very difficult. As you can see, I, I can't really talk too well. And I'm very nervous about work tomorrow because I'm afraid that when I serve coffee to customers, they're gonna think I'm weird or something. Or maybe even rude because I can't, because I'll probably be too nervous to even talk to them, to tell them to have a good day and whatnot. Eating, eating is really, really difficult as a password expander because. Well, I first tried drinking. I had a chai tea from work. I got myself a chai tea. And it was even very difficult to drink because um, when I brought my head back down, there was still liquid in my mouth and it would come into my mouth because the power to expander kept liquid from going down my throat. And it's very weird to drink, but it was even much more difficult to eat. I had like a shredded bit, shredded a uh, little burrito I was trying to eat and I kept getting very frustrated because the shredded chicken kept getting stuck in my palate expander and it took me a very very long time to eat and then after I was done eating I had to um clean my palate expander the best I could with a toothbrush and I'm gonna go see to my orthodontist if I can't give me like a wire brush to put between my mouth and the palate expander so I can clean it properly and also because I'm doing this action it it's because of the severe amount of saliva that is collected in my mouth because of foreign objects being in my mouth to begin with. And it's very hard to swallow um, liquid and my saliva. I'm just very afraid that it's just going to come out of my mouth and that's why I'm really afraid to talk and to open my mouth. Um, so my pre-op surgery date is going to be on the 27th and my surgery for my, I think it's my spar surgery is going to be on the 28th so I'm very excited about that but I'm not very too excited about 
about eating because I was very frustrated when I tried to eat today. Um, yeah. It's not so fun, but I hope it will get better in time. The doctor said that I only have to have it in until it heals properly, which is about three to four months after my surgery, so I'm just going to be very glad when that is over and done with. So, and I guess. I guess that's all I have to say. I think it's very difficult to talk because the tongue is, every time I talk, the, the tongue just hits the power to the expander and I can't, I'm afraid I'm not enunciating. I don't even know if any of you would, um, would understand what I'm saying. Hopefully I'll just get more used to it and more used to talking because I do sound very, very weird right now. Okay, well, I will update you before I get to my pre-op surgery, so I'll see you guys later.